Hello everyone. And uh, I just finished doing a maintenance charge on my battery as part of my winter storage um, routine. And I just realized that there is a small issue with this bike that I could address while I had everything off here. And that is if your bike all of a sudden lights up like a Christmas tree, the instrument cluster lights up like a Christmas tree, your speedometer turns into three dashes and your bike, your engine starts running really rough. Um, it's a quite common issue that one of these terminals has come loose. Uh, I read about this on uh, one of the uh, forums and like literally two days later it happened to me and, and this guy here had actually come loose. And the reason for this, as far as I can see, is that when BMW made this area for the battery, they made it a lot bigger than it had to be. So as you can see, the battery is freely able to move. Now these uh, cables are quite rigid. So as you're accelerating, braking, turning, the battery is going to sort of move around a little bit. And due to the rigidness of the, the cables, eventually these bolts are going to start, or these screws are going to start to come loose. And they're going to get more and more undone and eventually you get this problem. So, last year, I actually just pushed my battery back and I just got a folded up piece of cardboard. And I stuck it in, just wedged the battery in place. And this is another one that I just made. It's, it's literally just the center of a, of a toilet roll. And just wedged these guys in here. And now the battery can't move at all. So you can't actually end up with, with loose bolts anymore. Now I, did, I had this piece of cardboard here for a year. And um, uh, washing the bike or water, there's, there's really nothing that came in and ruined it. I did it as, an, as a temporary fix uh, over a year ago. But it held up so fine that, I mean, anyone's got a piece of cardboard lying around. So it's not difficult to fix. So now the battery's really in there. And that's the ice cream truck. Okay. <laughs> I got to edit out this. Okay. So anyway, this this battery is now really in there, and and you can't really end up with loose bolts or loose loose screws. Now, if this happens to you when you're on the road, if you still have the original seat, uh, the pillion seat, the passenger seat, whatever you want to call it. This um, wrench, Allen, Allen key, or it's a Torx key, will help you get the seat off to get those two bolts off. There's a screwdriver here, which will allow you to, well, tighten up these, uh, these screws enough for you to get home and then get a proper socket wrench on it and just, just do them up properly and, and see if you can find something to wedge in. So, yeah. That's my tech tip, so um, hope you enjoy this. I think this will also apply for the S1000RR, but this is a 2014 single R. And, uh, but I assume most of the bikes are the same. It's got the same frame, the same layout and everything. So it probably applies for the double R's as well. Possibly other bikes, but. So that's just my tip. Make sure your battery's secured in place and you won't have any sudden unforeseen issues where you lose, lose your speedometer, your ABS light will come on, your traction control light will come on, and your bike's going to start to run really rough. So, hope you enjoyed this, and thanks for watching.